Football has always been in Cassie Stefanik's blood. I actually wanted to play in high school, but my dad said no because <laughs> it's a bunch of guys. But after high school, she finally got her chance as the quarterback of the Lethbridge Steel women's team. I, know, I had a great time every time, even if we were losing, it was fun. But after just two seasons of living her dream, she was sidelined by concussions. It, uh, it definitely sucked. Yeah, it wasn't uh, what I wanted. Fortunately for the Steel, the sideline suited her just fine as Stefanik jumped right into a new role as an assistant coach. I want to be involved with the game, so it's a perfect way to do it, and uh, it's a blessing in disguise, that's for sure. Very, very smart coach, and uh, she has embraced her role, each year taking on more responsibility. Show, yeah, show me, like, just show me what you want to do. Ready, three, quick, the 24-year-old is now the Steel's top assistant and offensive coordinator, earning the respect of her team with her tireless work ethic and knowledge of the game. She knows what she's talking about, even watching and playing just the whole, all of her experience. She, she's just a phenomenal coach. But Stefanik isn't just great at her job, she's also a trailblazer. She's been in the province as Novice Coach of the Year, the first female to ever win a Football Alberta Coaching Award. Personally, I never thought of it that way. I always just, you know, I'm a coach just like the rest of these guys and just doing my job and having a good time doing it. But it's, uh, it's, it's cool and I hope I'm not the last woman to do it. And while she misses the thrill of being on the field. Every day, every, yeah, all the time I do. Her burgeoning coaching career is providing a whole new type of fulfillment. When I see the girls actually do something we've been working on, like, I'm like, oh yeah, we were working on that. I taught them that. That's, that's awesome. That feeling is, I love it. It couldn't get better than that.